The Auto DS Orders page has all of the orders that we have on all of our shops in one place. So let's learn about all of the options that we have available here. So first of all, as you can see, each order is separated with these lines. Each one separates a different order for a different product to a different customer. Let's take a look at this example. If you just click on the picture, you'll be taken to the customer's information, where to ship to. If you click on order, you'll see the system's information regarding this order, the status that it's in, which supplier it's from, and so forth. So that's what you get when you click on the photo. Next, you have the product's title, the date which it was sold on. The status shows the status that the order is in right now. So you have pending, ordered, shipped, delivered, and canceled. The first option is usually the next option that comes after the current status. So after pending, you can send it to auto order or from canceled, you can move it to pending and so forth. So if you're issuing your orders manually, you'll just have to change the status to whatever status the order is in right now. And if you're working with the fulfilled by auto DS or by the automatic orders features, auto DS will take care of changing the status for you and updating tracking information and so forth. All you have to do is make sure you have auto order credits. If you don't use the buy credit button over here to add credits, each order costs one credit. And if you're using the fulfilled by auto DS feature, then you can add your account balance right here. Always make sure that you have account balance. If you don't, you can load it over here. The difference between fulfilled by auto DS and automatic orders is for automatic orders, you have to supply your own buyer account and fulfilled by auto DS. You won't have to have any buyer accounts for that. Auto DS has their own buyer accounts. All you have to do is add your account balance, join the fulfilled by auto DS service. And that's all. The next option you'll have is to customize your display. If you click on that, you can customize whatever column that you want to see before any other column, or if you want to not see any columns, you can take them off, put them back on, update it, see your customized columns and so forth. The next option that we have after customized display is to export everything that you see on the orders page will be exported and sent to you in a CSV file to your email address. So all you have to do is enter your email, hit export, and the system will send it to you automatically in a very nice and organized fashion. So we talked about the options up here and the order information up until the status. So if you click on these three lines over here, you can go ahead and edit the order information, just like when you clicked on the image over here. Okay. It's the same effect. The item ID shows you the item on the source site and on your shop. The quantity is the quantity that the customer bought from that specific product, the customer's name, the store that it was bought from. The order ID shows you the order information on the source site and on your shop. The price is the price that you paid on the source site and the price that's shown on your shop. The profit is your total profit from each sale and the customer's full address, tax and tags if you had it will show up over here. And that's everything that you can see on the orders page. If you want any further information on auto ordering or fulfilled by auto DS, these are two very, very great automated services. Check out our help section. If you have any questions about the orders page, let me know below. I will personally answer your comments and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to learn a lot more about dropshipping and more about the auto DS monitor itself. We also have a live chat support open 24 seven for your convenience.